Welcome to the Saints practice report on Thursday, October 13th. I'm John DeShazer and we are at the indoor facility of the Oshner Sports Performance Center. Now the big news of this day, rookie receiver Chris Alave practiced for the second consecutive day and actually upgraded to limited in practice. So that's a good sight for the Saints to hopefully get their offense in gear on Sunday for the Cincinnati Bengals uh, defense. The Saints offensively have been a team that has been on the rise. The last six quarters, 57 points, 700 yards, and running back Alvin Kamara said there are reasons that the Saints offense has improved as of late. I, I, whenever we can get the ball, get the ball in, in to the running back room's hands, or I mean, take some head carries. Whenever we can run the ball, I feel like we play well because it, get, it just gets us going defensively and offensively. Now, on the other side of the ball, the Saints really have to clean it up defensively. They gave up six explosive plays to the Seattle Seahawks. Four of those plays resulted in touchdowns. And defensive coordinator Chris Richard said there are reasons that that happened and there are ways to clean that up. You know, it was a hell of a play by their offense, you know, so you have to take your hat off to them. But we have guys in position to get people on the ground, and that's what we need to do. It's not going to be perfect, but when we have guys in position, when it's not perfect, and we need you to get out of there, get them on the ground, eliminate again, eliminate the explosive passes, eliminate the explosive runs, and just give our defense a chance to line up and play again. Now, in addition to Olave being limited in practice, also quarterback Jameis Winston practiced for the second consecutive day. So he's moving along toward hopefully rejoining the lineup. But check out all of the injury report on NewOrleansSaints.com this afternoon. And we will hopefully see you tomorrow again for the practice report.